We have some breaking news for you now. Fargo police have arrested Mark Knorr. He's the man believed to be armed and dangerous. Police say he was making threats to law enforcement. And today, students and staff from Rasmussen College partnered with Lowe's and Integron to help landscape and revitalize the YWCA's lawn. Around 1,200 employees and students from a total of 23 campuses participated in the event in communities across the United States here in Fargo. Over 60 people volunteered their time by pulling weeds, remulching, and doing some landscaping projects. We have gave back 22,000 volunteer hours in 2014, 2015. Um, that's all part of our mission. So this is one of our favorite days. We're able to get off campus as a team and give back to our community. Today was the eighth annual Community Service Day event. The bells will again be going off the horse at the horse track in North Fargo this weekend to kick off another summer of races over the next three weekends. The North Dakota Horse Park will be holding its 11th season of racing. More than 200 horses will, around the region will be racing for first place. Trainers and owners say it takes a lot of training for the young horses to place. Gates open at 11 a.m. and races start at 1 p.m. And the Red River Valley Fair is in full swing. And if you paid a visit this morning, you may have spotted some familiar faces. Valley News Live competed in the annual food eating contest. Our very own Yovana Simich had to eat peach flavored chicken wings. Meteorologist Robert Hahn took on some taquitos. And Chief Photographer Dave Erickson conquered some corn on the cob. The Radio FM media team took first. Our Valley News Live team finished second. They were really uh, <laughs> munching down there. They were just going to town. That's you know not. What? I appreciate the uh, the go for it. That's I, what you they know, did. They went for it and they 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 came away with a second place finish. You know what? We weren't first, but that's okay. We were just. We weren't last. We weren't last. Yeah. If you're so not first. Kudos to those three for doing that. <laughs> Thanks, uh, Alex. Whatever. Uh, the Minnesota Twins kicking off the second half tonight. We'll take a look back at the uh, first half. Okay, sounds good. We'll have that next for you in sports. <laughs>